I call this one my feisty number six. See, she's a fighter. I gotta hold her down. I'm restraining a, a very angry mom. Hi, my name is Joyce, and I'm here at Western Washington University's Shannon Point Marine Center to do my experiments on the European green crab. This crab is incredibly invasive, not only in Washington, but actually all over the world. And so my research is focused on looking at where the risk and the spread is going to be for these crabs. We're walking now into the crab shack. The first thing you'll notice in the crab shack is they're diabolical. One of the reasons these crabs are so invasive is that these females make 180 to 200,000 eggs per individual. Why they're so damaging is that they displace our native species of crabs, shellfish like oysters, like mussels. And so if you crunch the numbers, the impact to our Washington waters on the coast and the Salish Sea is tremendous. I want to show you this last one because she's really big. Bigger, brighter, and feisty as hell. Oh my God, look at that. I have been testing these orange eggs and they're tethered together like little umbilical cords to the mom. Climate change is happening everywhere in the world. The sea surface temperatures are rising. And as they do that, animals like this invasive green crab have yet another opportunity to invade new habitats. Mm -hmm. 